New Ireland is one province that has completed polling and is gearing up for counting beginning tomorrow. While polling was generally peaceful in the New Ireland central local level government at the Kasu Bio logging road, there were reports of a vehicle carrying ballot papers catching fire, but swift intervention by scrutineers helped save the ballot boxes. The province also faced voter names missing on the electoral roll. While polling officials said the electoral roll was an updated one from the 2017 roll, it was found that many voters that voted in 2017 could not find their names in the 2022 electoral roll. There were also instances where names of the dead are still on the electoral roll. Others who registered their names to vote in the recent five years did find their name. Uh, unfortunately, uh, the common roll is still an issue. We, uh, we have about 1,000 1, plus uh, uh, names, uh, registered names, eligible voters. But unfortunately, in this one, we only have about 500. That's a 50, uh, less by 50 percent, which is like it's not acceptable. With counting set for tomorrow onwards, New Islanders have been commended for a peaceful polling period. Counting for the Namatanai open seat will take place at the Stemper Hall in Namatanai town. For caving open, counting will be held at the Peter Torot Hall and the regional seat will be at the Fisheries College. Incumbent New Island Governor Sir Julius Chen has called for a full investigation of the Electoral Commission to take place. Thanks for watching TV One News. Please like and subscribe and don't forget to hit the notification bell to stay up to date with the latest news.